At NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida, technicians at Launchpad 39A are finishing up repair work on Space Shuttle Discovery's ground umbilical carrier plate, or GUP. On November 17th, the hydrogen vent line was reattached to the GUP. That vent pipe carries excess hydrogen gas safely away from Discovery to a flare stack where it is burned off. Teams will analyze the hardware fittings and pressure check the connections to look for any possible leaks. On November 5th, Discovery's launch for its STS-133 mission to the International Space Station was postponed until no earlier than November 30th because of a hydrogen leak at the GUP, which is an attachment point between the external tank and a vent line. hard to get going, but just be careful. The exposed Gore-Tex sealant. Yep. All the way. My tape is not in contact with the metal skin of the shroud. All the way around this way here. That's verified. We're good. Verified. Okay. Yeah, lift up on the hose a little bit? Next steps, we're going to start drawing it in and bring it up. We're going to have to bring it up some. I already got spots. But those two flanges do not touch. You want one inch here. Until we get. Okay. Stop, All right, right, there. Stop there. right there. Stop right there. Okay, I'm going to bring it up. All right. All right. Go ahead. Go ahead, Justin. All right. Uh, Bump one. Come up a little. Yeah, come up a little bit more. with the um, pry top center? Yeah. Okay. Uh, sure, do that. Yeah. 